In this tutorial, I'd like to show you Look Sweet 2 from Sheffield Softworks. This is a group of stylizing effects designed to bring your footage to the next level with some great looks. I'm in Final Cut Pro 10, but these effects work in motion and after effects as well. You'll find them in the effects browser under Sheffield Softworks. I have a bunch of different clips on my timeline that will demonstrate the different uses of the effects in this suite. My first clip is a runway model. I'll drag the super glam effect on the clip. Right off the bat, you can see the default effect makes the footage really pop with some crushed shadows and softening. The parameters are simple. We have control over the intensity of the effect. I'm going to push this a little higher. We can tweak the softening and the sharpening so it's perfect for our clip. I'd like this really soft and diffused. Then I can adjust my exposure to taste. Lastly, I'll toggle the process dropdown from full color to luma only to show you the difference between Super Glam affecting just the luma information and not touching the color information. Depending on your clip, you might want to only affect the luma. My next clip has an interview that was shot on a cloudy day. I'll drag Bounce Fill onto it. This effect simulates the use of a colored bounce reflector. We can tweak the color, which I'll warm slightly by pushing it towards the reds more. We can diffuse it slightly and adjust the intensity of the bounce. The inverse clip slider alters the influence of the fill light based on the color of the object in the scene. If I pull this down, you'll see my cool blue and green background elements warm up a bit. I'll find a happy medium. My third clip is a mountain scene with sky. I'll drop Vibrance Plus on it. You can see the saturation jump immediately. This effect increases the chroma faster in the lower saturation areas, so the image on the whole becomes more vibrant. The main intensity slider obviously intensifies this effect, but it allows you to also go into the negative, which does the opposite. It desaturates the chroma faster in the higher saturation areas. So you'll find this effect a lot more graceful on your image than a simple saturation effect. It has a few other modes. Pastel, which lightens the high chroma areas and makes them pale. And Enhance, which slightly brightens the higher chroma areas. This works well on people as it will add a glow to skin tones. The chroma map mode will show you the high and low areas of chroma, so you can get an idea of what the other modes will affect. Finally, Mr. Fix-It EZ uses some HDR photography techniques by brightening shadows and darkening highlights, and then mixing them back into the image without affecting the color. Checking the flatten highlights box will also give us an overall brighter image. Consider this a footage rescue system. Look Suite 2 is a must-have group of effects for creating looks, stylizing, and fixing your footage. FX Factory offers a huge selection of great plugins, and if you don't have them yet, I suggest you go try them out at noiseindustries.com.